So, um, so I'm here with Hadi. Hadi. So, if you can show me your badge. Yes, um, absolutely. Okay. So it's Hadi. Hadi. Tabara. Uh, tell me what you do. I am a professor of water. I am all, uh, I'm a, uh, uh, the chair of the Department of Water Resources at a university named the American uh, University of Technology. That's in Byblos, Byblos, Lebanon. Yeah. Byblos is a uh, the oldest Phoenician inhabited city in the world, so so it's a pretty uh, historic. And uh, uh, we have a new major, uh, water resources. It's a multidisciplinary major. We teach water engineering, water science, water economics, water law at the undergraduate level. So we are unique in that in that area. Yeah. Now, putting that putting that kind of program together, how, how do you make decisions about what to include, and 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 how how do you make it relevant to to today? Good question. Um, we are looking at the market. We are looking, uh, uh, where are the jobs? What kind of jobs? What are the interests? There's water scarcity. There are water engineers everywhere. There are civil engineers everywhere. There are scientists everywhere. But there are not water leaders. We're creating water leaders. That's what we are. We, we, who knows, uh, uh, who are jack of all trades, but maybe maybe at the undergraduate level, they're, not, they're a master of none, but they do understand a lot of the issues that are presented, for example, at this. At this. So somebody said to me a few weeks ago that the, 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 most organizations have a, 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 a surplus of managers and the dearth of leaders. <laughs> that couldn't be uh, less true, yes, I, I agree, I totally agree. When you, when you talk about leaders and water leaders, how, what, what what is leadership and what, what's the difference between people that just administer water services and people that lead? A leader is, 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 a, is a person who can wear different hats. A leader is a person who knows the, uh, 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 the technology, who knows the science, who knows a little bit of the engineering. A leader who has a, a, a good grasp of the, mainly of the policy and the economics. A leader is a manager, so he has to, he or she has to have a a good leadership and managing skills. And specifically, when I, when we say what are the leadership skills, is the are, are the integrating. That's, that's the person who can integrate, who can look at the picture from 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 ent yeah. entirety and not a specific technological issue. Yeah. So I'm not, I'm not I'm in the Lebanon. You're you're there. So are you are, are the people that are coming through? Through the course, are they? Um, are you expecting them to carry continue working in Lebanon, or is it maybe is it international? Or We're, yes, the the jobs in Lebanon are, are are not enough for all graduates. So, and the Lebanese, they are like the Phoenicians; they like to travel. <laughs> <laughs> so, we hope we we hope to export them into the international arena, like you know places like the UN and the World Bank and other places where uh, where they can work uh, 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 in the water uh, solving water problems all over the world okay. and Africa and I'm hoping some of our students will go and join uh, uh, water aid organizations and, and, and everywhere yeah great well great to meet you thanks thank you Juan. thanks very much